Hey, I bet you're wondering how Walter and I ended up together. I just assumed you were twin brothers. So many similarities. We met at a party. Or was it the DMV? I can't remember. Anyway, one thing I do remember is Walter didn't judge me for how I looked, how I talked, how I dressed. He told me, don't judge people, judge their actions. He was he kind of a zen motherfucker that way, and I loved him for it. He and I talked about you a lot. Oh, my character moment sense is tingling. Well, there's something special about you. But it's buried beneath a whole lot of wise ass. Oh, gee whiz, thanks for the revelation. Damn it, I just proved your point, didn't I? Like I said, man, I don't judge people, just their actions. My point is, don't yeah. let you get in the way of yourself. Did you just cook up a philosopher amp or something? Me. Hey, you said it, not me. These traps, nice designs. Real cream? Hello? Maybe he's inside. Locked. I will not be defeated by a locked door. Plan B, to the roof. breaking into a Japanese museum. How did you get in here? I'm looking for a guy named Brill Cream. Troop Master Brill Cream is... missing. Well, maybe I can help you find him. Maybe you'll be lucky if I let you live. Kind of a dick, huh? Treason! Arrest for Kim and banish her from the troop! Chill out, Mussolini. I am the troop master, and this is my troop! Aw, oh, man. Are you gonna tell me where Brill Cream is or what? You wanna find Brill Cream? You must do as I say. Radio Tower. 
My troop has been trying to locate Troopmaster Brill Cream via radio, but all they hear is this. Doctors recommend drinking 17 cans of overcharge a day. <laughs> the radio station is located here. If you destroy all three transmitters around the tower, we have a better chance of locating Troopmaster Brill Cream. So, you think you can do that? Sure thing. Be right back. Transmitters blew up so big. Holy shit. Looks like that cute's nest.
destruction of property is a serious crime. <laughs> Get ready to die, asshole! A giant blip is attacking me. This code marketing is getting really aggressive. Hey, you know what sounds like fun? If you stop moving for a second! Today is Laser Appreciation Day! Norton, fixed your radio for you. What? You're alive? I'm not gonna lose to a blimp. That'd <laughs> be humiliating. Well, yeah. my troop <laughs> thanks you for your service. Goodbye. Wait. You let me know if you find Brill Creek, right? Oh, yes, Brill Creek, of course. We'll 
Keep looking for it. Thank you again. Hey, it's Sam. Come back to our base. There's someone here that wants to talk with you. And she's kind of cute. Careful out there, it's dangerous. And I don't hey, hey, hey. You know that big parking garage in old little Tokyo? It's packed with all kinds of electronics we could totally use. But it's scab turf. You know what? You could lure some OD over there to help take care of the scabs. My sociology prof said passive aggressive warfare is the future. My name is Forkin. Hey, sorry about that whole banished from the troop thing. It's for the best. Troopmaster Norton is a bad guy. Even though he says he's trying to find Brill Cream, he's not. I overheard him whisper something about Troopmaster Brill Cream at the hot dog factory. I hear this Brill Cream guy is really smart. He's a genius. A genius that might be trapped in a hot dog factory? I'm worried. He's been missing for a couple of weeks. We'll find him. You mean, I'll find him? Someone has to stay here and comfort for Kim. Right. Keep up the good work, Sam. So what's the deal with the hot dog factory? Trying to survive the apocalypse, hot dogs are the last thing you should eat. True Master Brill Cream is a master at boosting morale. Maybe he thought a hot dog cookout would lift the spirits of the troop. Oh, that's funny, because I prefer to lift my spirits with actual spirits. Alcohol is a depressant and has many health risks. You're right. Better to eat processed pick. Okay, I'm at the hot dog factory. Look around for signs of Troopmaster Bro. Uh oh, scabs. And it looks like they decided to upgrade their arsenal. Where did they get those new weapons? They're not smart enough to design them on their own. 
you might have to deal with some scabs while you look for evidence. You think? Scabs and evidence go together like, uh, hot dogs in the factory. A day without killing and looting. <laughs> Found a Japanese sword. Not something a troop leader would have. Yeah, it seems weird, doesn't it? But it could be Brokoos. He never went anywhere without it. I feel like that could have been useful intel to have at the top of this caper. But we need more evidence. Troop leader's hat. Seems like something a troop leader would wear. That could be Brill Creeps. He was always wearing his hat. I think we just need one more piece of evidence. You guys sure do things by the book, don't you? Troop Master Brill Cream teaches us that discipline is the most important virtue. Discipline found a bugle. Now that would only be something a troop leader would have, right? How could he carry a bugle? Sometimes. But I'm not sure why he would have brought that with him. Yeah, yeah, you're right. This could be anyone's bugle. Okay, I'm convinced. Either Brokery is here, or he was here. You should check inside the factory. Brokery is a trained survivalist. He may have locked himself inside. See if you can find a way to bust down a door, or even a wall. Construction equipment around. Anything that might help you get inside. Yeah. <laughs> Use the crane to bust down the wall. Yeah. No keys. Wait, cranes have keys? Huh. What would Batman do? Probably read this note out loud. Meet me in the park for a picnic. I love you. Well, that's helpful. Guess I'm going to the park to look for some keys. And maybe even have a date. <laughs> Hey, 
Hey, for Cam. Sam's not being too annoying, is he? Not anymore. He kept trying to hold my hand, so I put my judo badge into action and snared him in a rear naked choke. Nice. But go easy on him. I get the sense he doesn't have much experience with the ladies. Well, he's been a perfect gentleman since. He showed me around, I met his friends, he even taught me how to do a little C++ coding. Yeah. Wow, you should sure invite me to the wedding. I love free food. Wait, what? Okay, I found the picnic site. It's like the crane guy either turned OD or was mauled. Damn, need those keys to the crane. If we're lucky, he turned OD. Go kill some and see if any of them have the key. Ah, that's what I need. Fizco bots. Doesn't look like any car key I've ever seen. But if this doesn't start to train and I have to keep running around killing OD and looking for keys, I'll probably rage quit. Yeah. Hey, Fort Kim, you there? Yes. Did you find the key? Yeah, but I have something more important to talk about. Okay. So what do you think of Sam? Really? I don't know why, but he kind of reminds me of this class turtle we had in fourth grade. We set him free in the ocean one day. Then we found out later that he was a freshwater turtle. Don't tell Sam that story. Pallets were actually overcharged deliveries. Now this place is about to be stupid with OD. Good thing I have godlike crushing power. <laughs> I better crush those OD before they turn into poppers. 